gain some benefit. So if you take the Daban Wikimedia user group, for example, we are just a young group of volunteers. Nobody pays us. So if you come in and you feel like, oh, this is like a job that I will come in and benefit. All of that, uh, all of us who are already familiar with our community, we don't pay people for contributing to Wikipedia. And what you need to know as a first step coming in is that um, those who contribute to Wikipedia, especially within the Japan language community, is that we care so much about the language because we are speakers of the language, because we are the homeless, or we are part of the system of the band language that the user group is currently supporting. We want to be counted, we don't want to be left out. That is the first step. That is what drives us, if you ask me, that is the motivation. We are, whilst we are doing that, many other things come up and then we tend to benefit. For example, if you are a student, I, when I started college, but then I was already competent. But I learned so many things that most Wikipedians are, I will not say they are smart, but they know so many things. Once you are a Wikipedian, like you be automatically, automatically, you know so many things that people don't know. When you are talking, you might not even realize that people see you like someone who is knowledgeable, someone who knows so much about uh, the internet. So it will just automatically change your way of life and how you find information, how you respond to things. When you go to social media and people are reacting in a certain way, you will understand why they are not like behaving like the way you should. Because the movement is big. We have over 3,000, let me just say 3,000, maybe uh, within Africa, contributors, millions, and global, we have over 10,000 people just like us all contribute to media in different ways. Within the movement, we have different projects. So if there are somebody who is not uh, very good with writing or you don't want to write articles on the Wikimedia platform, you can contribute images or videos, which is uh, Wikimedia Commons. You can contribute structured data, wiki data. You can contribute like um, things. Lexings, you can create lexicographical data in your language. We have about eight projects, Wikimedia for the Wikimedia Commons, Wiki for Yard. So if you have someone who likes to travel around your community, you can document the tourist sites. All of them are just to put your community or your county on the map. When you go to the internet, so people can access information about things that relate to your culture and language. So we do Wiki Labs Africa. Wiki Labs Earth, Wiki Labs Monument, Wiki Labs Folklore, Wiki Labs uh, what we are there. Some people have Wiki Labs Butterfly and all of that. But we do Wiki Labs Folklore. The Wiki Labs Folklore helps us to write about our folk culture, uh, our cultural heritage, the food we eat, the languages we speak, dresses and all of that. So we usually take buses around town or nearby communities to take pictures and videos of these unique. Uh, Things, artifacts, buildings, 